So I'm doing my fourth year mechanical engineering design project and this is our moment of truth. If in the next second this doesn't work, everything is gonna break and I'm not graduating probably. All right, let's see if the wind turbine we're, we're building, if the electrical components are actually gonna work. This is the moment of truth. I just need to plug this into the multimeter and spin this generator in the next seconds. If I don't see five volts here, I'm cooked. Let's see, this is the first time I'm gonna try it. I'm fucking terrified. All right. <laughs> Follow me to stay tuned how this goes. So far, our electrical components passed. All right. Now, next step is we got to manufacture all of this. And uh, we're going to make this out of real recycled wind turbine blades that got turned into 3D printing filament. So these parts are 3D printed and they are going to be made from what used to be real recycled wind turbine blades. Cool stuff, man. Stay tuned. Let's see how this goes. What's scary is these components don't cost nothing and uh, we're using our client's budget to buy these components. We requested these components. You know, everything until now for the last like semester and a half, it's all been theoretical calculations and research. But we never actually touched the real components and tested them together with all the wires connected. So if it didn't work, it's a whole other month of uh, research again and calculations and reordering the stuff to make sure our product works. And uh, we got to redesign the entire thing because this is supposed to host these components. But since it's working, we can sleep at night in peace. When I say we, it's me and my teammates, my three other teammates. Shout out Lucas, shout out Manu, shout out Phil. Bro. Extra props to Manu for taking care of the electrical. Especially the fact that like we're not in electrical engineering, we're in mechanical engineering. So every time we see electricity, we're terrified. This is not the most complicated circuit. And uh, we've seen more complicated circuits. It's just that we don't work with this shit every day. You know, usually we just stick to uh, stuff that doesn't involve electricity and wires and shit. <laughs> we look at this little cool sci-fi looking 3D printing testing rig that I designed to test uh, our, our, our uh, blade rotation with wind, <laughs> cool stuff.